Well, today was the first day of competition in the 75th annual Continental Cup Ski Jumping Tournament in Iron Mountain. TV6's Iron Mountain Kingsford Bureau reporter Abby Miller was at the jumps today and brings us the story up close. The spirit of the Olympics is everywhere we go, but instead of having to fly all the way to Sochi to get some real Olympic action, Iron Mountain is the next closest venue. 112 and a half meters. It was the first day of the ski jumping competitions at the massive and majestic Pine Mountain Ski Jump. The atmosphere is great, but the jumping is always good. Uh, sounds like the weather is going to be great tomorrow. Adam and his friends have claimed this prize tailgating spot for a long time. We've been coming to the jumps for approximately 20 years since we were young, young kids. We get it every year. Right, here we go. But let's be honest, while Adam and his friends do enjoy the competitions, I'm going to go on record saying the hill record falls this year. It's also a great excuse to let loose a little. We'll have Bloody Marys for breakfast. But shifting now from the bottom of the hill to the top, you'll find yourself in the midst of over 60 professional athletes from all over the world. They say they enjoy this jump as it's different than others they're used to. You can go really low and still go far and fly close to the, to the hill all the way and okay. kind of take off at the bottom, so we like that. The competitions were delayed just a bit today, but the weather was perfect for the jumpers to keep great form in the air. We want to keep them uh, in somewhat of a, an angle away from your body to create the most flotation coming down, kind of like an airplane. The tournament begins again on Saturday with opening ceremonies at 1215 Central Time and then on Sunday at 1 o'clock. Reporting at the Pine Mountain Ski Jump in Iron Mountain, Abby Miller, TV6 News.